to do the 200 Club drawing today. In kindergarten, we have Sammy Wilson in Hashimoto and Audrey Thorell in Hashimoto. Good job, guys. In first grade, we have Aiden in Eastins and Alex Gleason in Miss Aced. In second grade, we have Ben in Miss Jones and Ruby in Mrs. Delaney. Good job, guys. In third grade, we have Janan in Basie and Ava in Mrs. Lovells. In fourth grade, we have Hannah in Mrs. Wetzel and Malia in Klein. Fifth grade, we have Guy Kruger in Mitchell and Dallas in Mrs. Mitchell's class. And last, in sixth grade, we have Taylor Rosander in Morgan's class and Nathaniel in Mrs. Morgan's class. Good job. If you heard your name, come up to room 102 for your class at first recess. <laughs> Congratulations to Ella. She read five Battle of the Book books and got entered into the district drawing. And she was one of the winners. So she now gets to go see Jeff Kenny and get one of his autographed books. Hey, we got lots of new books in for you to see. Uh, we'll start with fiction. These are for third grade on up. We have a new book called Applesauce Weather, a really cute story. Um, another book called Elliot and the Goblin War. This is really fun. It's written by Jennifer Nielsen, and she wrote The False Prince and A Night Divided and a few other books. This was her very first book that she wrote. I've been trying to get it for a long time. Finally got it. It's a really fun story. When Mischief Comes to Town is about a girl who's lost her parents and she moves to a small little town in Denmark to stay with her grandmother. And everybody there is really stern and she just, with her mischief, adds a little something new to the town. And this one, Waylon, is by the same author who writes the Clementine books. And Waylon is in the Clementine books, but she is doing a new series just all about Waylon. And as you read through, you will see Clementine throughout the story a little bit, but it's mostly based on Waylon and his experiences. It's a really good book. I just read it the other day. Those are your fiction. We also have some new picture books. This one, Ninja, Attack of the Clan. If you've read the Beehive nominee this year that's called Ninja, this is the second book in that series. So if you like Ninja, you'll probably like that one. This one is a really interesting story. Teachers, you might enjoy reading this to your class too. It's called Two Friends. It's about Frederick Douglass and Susan B. Anthony, famous people in history. They actually were very good friends and were fighting for similar causes. And they met together once for tea at Susan's house, and this is the author imagining what they maybe would have said to each other. And then if you're a fan of the Flora books, there's a new one out, Flora and the Peacocks, and we have that available. Here are some other new picture books. <laughs> Oh no! Please review in class today hallway expectations. We know it can be hard to stay silent, but we must. When you talk in the halls, the sound of your voice echoes because of the tile floor and walls. When you talk in the halls, you are disrupting other classes and interrupting student learning. Please work extra hard this week to remember to be silent in the halls. Thank you, Cougars. And remember, our three school rules are to be respectful, be responsible, and be safe, always. So far, we have learned about hallway expectations, gym expectations, and restroom expectations. Do you remember what the expectations are?
had some problems in our restrooms lately. If you see something wrong in our restrooms, please tell the office immediately. If you see others doing things in the restrooms that are wrong, please let your teacher know. Please treat our wonderful school with respect.